<laughs> Actually, gonna go on ahead and uh, grab all that I can in this area. Be careful when you're opening, you know, these crates and um, barrels because um, sometimes they'll have snakes in them, and uh, it'll give you a bit of an opening to try and kill them off. But they can attack you. They won't kill you, but they are annoying when they jump out at you. Anyway, we'll climb down this secret well here. Um, should be a couple of crates here, actually. That could be... Well, maybe. I don't know. It's been a while. Shoot this thing right here, then you can reveal some item. Oops. Reveal some items that you can shoot down. Like a spinel. You also find a headdress piece, which I believe this is it right here. Yep, and then uh, another spell right here, I believe. Indeed. Alrighty. So let's continue onward. And forward. And backwards. And diagonally. Got something that might interest you. Hello, merchant. Got a selection of... Yeah, yeah, I know. I'm working on it, what buddy. Um, but let's see. I want to sell that. Ah. Sell this. <laughs> Definitely Thank sell you. that. Is that all? And that. All right. <laughs> Thank you. All right. What can we buy here? What are you buying? Actually, I feel like buying another weapon. So let's buy another weapon. Um. Let's buy a TMP. Is that all? We'll get good use out of this weapon. I promise you. We'll also buy a stock, because it actually steadies your aim, believe it or not. <laughs> You're welcome. You. What are you buying? So, let's see if we can upgrade our little TMP here. Is that all? Is that all? Is that all? What actually, I can just upgrade my shotgun Is here. That Is that all? Alright, so we got nothing Thank else you. to upgrade. Let's actually... What are you buying? Go on ahead and... Oh, we don't have enough. Fuck. Sup, sir. Alright, so... Be sure, when you get a stock, you want to be able to go on ahead and combine them with the TMP. What this is supposed to do is steady your aim when you aim your TMP. Like you see, it's actually really steady. You can actually have an easier time aiming your TMP or whatever. This will be the same with the Red 9, which is... My favorite pistol, and I'll most likely stick to it. But, uh, yeah. So, once we're done, we can just climb on up here. And, uh... Go to church! Or the cemetery. Actually, I think there's actually, um... Let me take a few steps back here. No? I thought there'd be, like, a bird's... Oh, yep, see? There we go. So, yeah, cemetery. We're actually going to be looking thoroughly here because there's blue medallions! But uh, first I'm going to go on ahead and uh, get rid of what I can in terms of villagers. Oh hi! Don't think so. All right, so let's see. Gonna take my time here. Can't be, can't be too careful here. So I should go on ahead and get this blue medallion now. All right. So we actually want to keep an eye here because we we'll actually see twin statues, uh, tombstones here. This one has an S. So that's S. You want to keep an eye on the twin um, tombstones. So we have S. <coughs> There's actually another one over here. This is form of an M. And of course the last one being way up here in form of a V. So we got S, M, and V. Keep that in mind. That will help you and a little puzzle that we'll run into here in a bit. Ok, 
Goodbye. I love when that happens. I love doing that. Anyway, uh, medallion here. And we're gonna be, uh, looping around the back here. There we go. Takes care of that. Alright, so this little particular thing. Remember when I said we have to keep the S, M, and V in mind? Well, in this particular little puzzle... We're actually going to be lighting the S, M, and V to get this piece of jewel for the Beerstein mug. But the key to this puzzle is that it moves into increments of 3 and 4. We're going to start with 3, then 4, then 4 again, then 4 again. Or I think I did that wrong, to be honest. And 3, 3, 3. And there you go. Actually worked out. So now we got the green cat's eye. We got what we came here for. Actually, we're supposed to go to the church uh, first, but if I actually make it past, we'll get <laughs> we'll trigger a cutscene. Leon, have you reached the church yet? Uh, yeah, sort of. <laughs> Leon, did I mention not to take the scenic route? At any rate, Ashley's probably inside that structure. Rescue her. Hurry! Oh, goodness, Leon. Goodness, goodness, goodness. Alright, so... Uh, okay, no, I don't want to go back here. I meant to go to the front door. Let me go on ahead and reload here. I'm not quite done with this area yet, but... We can't continue onward unless we investigate this door. And of course, it won't open, so let's contact Hunnigan again. Hunnigan, it's Leon. The door's locked. I can't get in. Didn't they teach you how to pick locks at the academy? Da -da. Yeah. Da -da 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 -da. There's some sort of indentation like something might fit inside. Well, there's no use standing around. Leon, you have to find some way or something to get inside. Well, there goes that mystery. So let's go on ahead and move down here now. Goodbye. this. I live now 15. Not bad, not bad. Uh, this is where we'll be running into snakes here, ladies and gentlemen. Continue, for, starting off with this box right here, if you get a good swing with your knife, you'll be able to kill a snake, and uh, you'll get the chicken egg from it. So, closure of the church. Regarding the two fugitives, the apprehension of Lewis is our top priority. The American agent, a distant second. What Lewis stole from us is far more important than the girl. Unless we get it back, the girl will become useless to us. We must get it back to execute our plan to the end. If it gets in the wrong hands, the world would become a totally different place than the, that Lord Sadler has envisioned. At all costs, we mustn't let that happen. Nevertheless, we are not letting go of the girl. To ensure that the agent does not get to her, I have locked the church door where the girl is being held. Anyone who needs access to the church must first get approval by Lord Sadler. There is a key beyond the lake, but it should be safe now that the Del Lago has been awakened by our Lord. No one will get across the lake alive. Plus, our same blood courses through the agent's veins. It will be just a matter of time before he joins us. Once he does, there will be nobody else left that will come looking for the girl. So, um, yeah, if you haven't caught on to that, we have an egg implanted in our system. It's lovely. 
fuck off. <laughs> I love doing that. Oh wait, hold on. Here's the fun part. Do I have a flash? Yes, I do. Yes. This is the fun part. Walk in here. You see this little... When I walk in, anyway. A little further. See those crows right there? Those magnificent crows? Not there anymore, are they? <laughs> Always do that, because... Honestly, you'll get a lot of treasure. You get a flash grenade back anyway, so I mean, why not? Why not do that? So, uh, yeah. Fun little fact. I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, search these little places too, because they have ammunition. Why not? bit of ammunition, a piece of treasure here and there. There'll actually be more in these little places later when we uh, investigate them, but uh, for now let's investigate them now and take what we can. Anyway, let me go ahead and equip my handgun back. <laughs> I don't think we can go this way yet, can we? Oh, we can. Maybe we are supposed to go this way. Yeah, we are supposed to go this way. I forget. Um, <coughs> I just usually take a little detour because, you know, the merchant's there. Yeah, yeah, yada. Anyway, another boulder chase thing. Did he? So just keep sprinting and sprinting and sprinting and sprinting and sprinting. And sprinting. <laughs> No, that killed me, my first death in the game. And this is why, <laughs> this is why I don't like contact sensitive in, you know, controllers. 